What's up, everybody, and welcome back to my channel, The Life of Charm. Of course, my name is Sade. I'm going to keep saying that for the first couple of times so you guys can get back used to it. And for all of my new subscribers, remember, like, share, comment, and also subscribe to my channel, guys, so you can just get to know me a little more. So today we are going to do a mukbang on Zaxby's. Y'all, I'm about to eat. This food smells so good. I'm trying to, I had to hurry up. I had a little trouble before we started this video, but you know what? I ain't even gonna worry about it. I'm still gonna do this video. I'm gonna make it happen. But yeah, a lot has just happened in like the last few moments, literally. But anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and say grace and then we can get started. I'm gonna chat a little bit and we just gonna have a good time and eat good food. Okay, dear God, thank you for this food. We're about to receive and bless your hands and prepare it for the nourishment of my body. And it's in your son's name that I do pray. Amen. All right, so we got Zaxby's. I got a lot of food. Of course, I'm probably not going to eat all of it, but we about to make it do what it do. So I did get a chicken, Cajun chicken club sandwich. It comes on a bun, but I always get Texas toast because their bread is so good. So this is the Cajun club sandwich it's really good i can't wait to bite into that and then i also got the wings and things combo with tongue torch and i got onion rings because i love their onion rings the batter on them is so freaking good and i got traditional wings and then i got of course it comes with chicken tenders and onion rings so yeah i'm about to your girl about to eat like real life I'm about to eat. Let me see how I want to set this up. What's going to be the best way? Okay. Put my drinks. I got a cup of ice. I put my ice there because they be trying to give you. I don't listen. I sip it from the drink. Okay. The sauces I got is high honey mustard. I like that with my chicken tenders. And then I got ranch. Of course, that's with my tongue torch wings. And then I got Zach sauce. And that's for my onion rings. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm hungry. My stomach is talking to me right now. As I continue to talk to y'all, and I'm sure my stomach is like stop talking. So let's start with an onion ring. Oh, y'all, they always so crispy with their Zach sauce. Mm, mm mm. Yeah. That's it. That's it. I'm gonna get my napkins ready. So, how was you guys' day today? I hope it was good. I got a lot of work done today. I got a lot more work to do tomorrow. I'll work on Friday. So I'm excited. I'm still on onion rings right now, guys. But yeah, work was really pretty cool today. I got a lot done. Um... Oh, my makeup look good too. I did my makeup really simple, like easy to be. And I'll start doing makeup sometimes on my channel too. But I'm not a makeup artist. I don't aspire to be one. I'm just like being pretty. Um, I did my brows, of course, with Dip Down from MAC. And then I did, I used their Pro, um, Pro Long Wear Concealer to conceal my eyes and under my eyes. I used Watch Me Blush Palette Hot Cocoa on my eyes and then Matte Amber Lights on top in my crease. I think that's what that is. See, I don't even know. Um, eyeliner with some lashes, Maybelline Fit Me all over with my Bobbi Brown Highlight Brick. And that's it. Something simple so I wouldn't be looking too basic on this channel for y'all. My eyebrows are not done right now. Otherwise, I wouldn't have done them. I got to get them threaded before my birthday next week. I might do it on my birthday. 
Y'all, I'm so excited about my birthday. I have like a whole day planned for myself. Literally by myself. I'm gonna go to the spa, get my nails done, feet done, massage, eyebrows, of course. And then makeup, get dressed. And then dinner. I'm gonna go to dinner and I'm gonna have salsa night. So we'll be just doing salsa dancing for my birthday. Okay? That's my plan. Should be fun. Okay, moving along. Let's get a chicken tender. I went to Zaxby's in Signal Mound. I live in Red Bank now. I'm in Chattanooga, Tennessee. Okay, this is the hot honey mustard sauce. Can y'all see that? Okay. Zaxby's and Sigma Mountain. Now, I will say, anybody, if y'all look, I love Zaxby's. I love Chick fil A also, but I love Zaxby's because you got more variety. It's not just chicken sandwich, chicken nuggets, and that's it. It's salad. They got chicken tenders, onion rings, chicken wings, boneless wings, chicken tenders. I mean, they got more stuff. So, and it's good. Now, it was a day of time when you can go put an order in his desk. And it took about 20 minutes. And I was okay to wait that 20 minutes. Because you knew. I want mine to come up hot and fresh every time. You know what I mean? This is hot, don't get me wrong. It's hot. Plus, like I said, some stuff went wrong at the house. So I was supposed to come back and just start my video, but then didn't happen as planned. But it's okay. I will survive. Why it toast be so good? Ooh. Golden and crispy. It ain't burnt. You know what I mean? It's good. Lightly buttered. <laughs> okay. I'm still eat my celery. I love celery. That's the best part when you get wings. So. I'm also going to go to Nashville next Friday for my birthday. So, all of my Chattanooga, Nashville, Memphis subscribers, y'all want to come turn up with your girl? I would love to see you. Let's get into this sandwich, though. It is grilled, so I'm kind of doing a little something healthy, maybe. Not really. Y'all, it's so good. They put the right amount of occasion on it. it every time it be good. Every time. Y'all, something crazy, like really crazy and random just happened. I'm going to have to tell y'all my next video for story time. I finished, well not finished, I won't say finish. I got to a good place on my office space. Got some things cleared up and separated, organized. Got my desk in there, organized. So, excited about that. Got that done yesterday. I have to do some more cooking tomorrow because I have to take some pictures because 
I have a huge announcement coming out Friday. Make sure y'all tune in for the announcement. I'm going to do a video. I'm going to make the announcement on my video. I'm also going to announce it on live on Facebook and Instagram Friday. So, y'all be looking for those videos. And be sure to comment, message me. Let me know what videos y'all want to see. I definitely want to do a lot of local Chattanooga restaurants to get them some shine, you know what I mean? And then, I'm not a huge fast food eater. So, like, fast food to me is actually Chipotle, Taco Bell, and then Checkers. That's about the, I don't eat McDonald's. I eat that breakfast. I don't eat Burger King. Oh, Popeye's can see this fast food. But to me, I don't really consider it fast food because it's chicken, you know what I mean? But. Now, see, Zach, this we're going to have a problem. What is this? This wing is not complete. Don't give me a deficient wing. Signal Mountain, Zaxby's. She is deficient. Something wrong with her. I got onion rings, but look like y'all weren't paying attention to the basket because it ain't nothing but fries and the y'all. I'm a good caller. I will call y'all manager in a minute. This wing right here don't even have no stop. Now see, I'm s I, I hate to do a video and then I had my experience bad because then now when I post a video, y'all gonna be sending this a, a Zexpus review. And it's bad. Again, that's why I said I remember a time when Zexpus used to be 20 minutes waiting on a meal, not ready when you pull up. I knew that line was moving too fast. Cook that stuff fresh. Slow down. Take your time. This sandwich was good, though. But I'm disappointed. And what's going on with my wings? Y'all, so let me tell y'all, I'm on my way to work this morning. It's like 7 20. I'm like about to pull up. My grandma called. Now, that's not up normal. My grandma woke up real early. That's when she talked to the Lord. So she'd be up at 5. Her time. 6 my time. That's her normal. So. She called me. Mmm, this is so good. And we just talking, you know, talking, catching up. Talking, talking, talking. Well, then I get to work and I'm in the parking lot. She's still talking, so I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna go in because I don't clock in, so I don't have to worry about, oh, I'm late. But. I don't like being on the phone in the office. You know, folks be in your business. You don't want to hear about everybody in the conversation. So, I was like, I'm late. And I just went on in because she kept talking. So, I get to my desk. I'm logging in. I know she hear me talking. But we still talking. And I say we. But I'm pretty much like, okay, okay. Mm-hmm. For real. Okay. And she just... She just going. Like, she ain't stopped yet. So, um, she started talking about me and giving me relationship advice, y'all. It's not that I don't want to hear it, but it's like, I'm not the one that needs the relationship advice. It it's these gentlemen, the men. They need the relationship. Grandma, I need you to 
Call these folks, these men who don't got no grandmama and tell them what you tell to me because they don't know what you said to me. It ain't no point of you said to me because you've been telling me this all my life. I need somebody to call these men and tell them this because so we got on that conversation. She want grandchildren, great grandchildren. She ain't going to get them from me no time soon. Because of course, you know, guys, I want the traditional route. And not traditional in the sense that that's all it is. It's tradition. It's something that I want. I want a relationship. I want to date. I want to be courted. I want marriage. And then come a baby. If it doesn't happen in their order, but at least it still happens with somebody who I know I can be with in a marriage, I'm okay with that too. So... But my standard, my goal is marriage first. And I don't, I mean, I just don't even know if I see it happening no more, Lord. Ooh, this name was good. So, I don't know. Do y'all still believe in love? Do y'all believe in marriage the same way, you know, that it happened before? What are y'all, you know, thoughts on marriage and love and dating and relationships and communication and expectations, standards? Like, what are your thoughts on it? Y'all comment down. Let me know. I am going to message y'all back. But let me know what y'all think, man. Okay. Wrench. Turn torch wing. I will say that I'm a pretty open person, open to new things, open to different types, open to new adventures, open to being unconventional and not traditional, but it has to fit for me. I still have to get what I want out of it. I think so much for me, previous, I can't speak for women and all women, but I know it does. It is a huge character trait for a lot of black women. I've been so worried before about what men want and what makes them happy and doing for them. And I mean, a dude been and not showed me not one bit of nothing that I want. Other than, you know, he killed... He showed me affection, attention, you know. It was enough to get me in. So now I'm still like hanging on to what was. But it was what was three months ago. Three months later, it's not that. You you know what I mean? Mm. Y'all don't even want to get me started on relationships. But it'll come. It'll happen when it's supposed to happen for me. I got so much other stuff going on right now. Yeah. I want to accomplish. I will pause, say this. Because I hate this excuse too. Oh, I'm trying to get to these goals. You should be able to still reach goals and, and date someone. I don't care. If you can't, then you're not for me. Because when we get together, we should still be trying to reach goals. When we separate and dating, you should still be trying to reach goals. You know what I mean? I hate that. Ooh, don't get me started on that one, child. But anyway, so yeah, y'all comment down. Let me know what y'all feel. What you think? And tell me the truth. You know, oh, I don't think I did a thumbnail. Well, it's gone. I'm gonna have to try to find one. Oh my god. So, y'all, let me tell y'all what happened. Because this is going to worry me, and I don't know what I'm going to do. Well, your mind, I'm not going to tell you that, because I don't think I can tell y'all that. Something really bad, and I keep looking at it, and it just makes me keep thinking about it.
anyway. That was good. I'm still upset about these wings though. I do plan to do a seafood boil coming up soon. Like a big one. I have a question. Maybe y'all can answer. Comment down. Let me know. Can you use a Walmart card at Sam's? They owned by the same person. I feel like I should be able to. I don't know. I'm going to check online and see. Can I use a Walmart gift card at Sam's? Maybe you have to say it for both. See, I had like a little squeeze lift and I put that in a cup full of ice and it almost looked like it's full. They would have gave me that and they would have been like, this your drink. See, I wouldn't get another drink. Oh, I made some tea, y'all. It's so good. It's like a, I did fresh lemon and mango in my tea. I brewed some tea. It's actually really, 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 really good. Really, really good. Y'all, the hot honey mustard sauce is actually really fat. Really fat. Really fat. What are we on? 22 minutes. 20 minutes. 20 something. Oh, I gotta go back and eat that out. I can't believe that's the Little hood. It just came out. Little hood. Little, just a little bit. I'm surprised, bro. Y'all probably behaving today. I'm gonna show you another odd video. Hmm. I'm getting full just this week. Yeah. Actually, I'm gonna try it and I'm gonna do a video. I'm gonna get the same sandwich in here. I'm gonna get the hot honey mustard and put that on the sandwich. My God, that's gonna be good. Mm. Yeah, this bread is so good. So, this is it, guys. This is it for me. I hope y'all are enjoying my videos. This is a growing, learning, fun process for me. I'm going to keep doing this because I really enjoy it. And... It's fun. I do plan to change my set setting again. My office will be where my where I do my videos. But right now, it's still kind of in the process of getting everything set up. My studio. <laughs> I like to call it my creative space. Um, I'm still getting that set up. Right now, I'm in my kitchen. And it's working. But I actually plan to paint my kitchen. So, I might be back in my kitchen once I paint it. Because it's just a really nice setup for me to do the videos. Supposed to be drinking water, Lord. But I see it'll bless anytime. But anyway, thank you guys for watching my video. Hopefully, you've watched it all the way to the end and you enjoyed me. Um, like, 
subscribe, comment, share this video, share, share, share. Let people know if you like me, maybe somebody else will like me too. So, you know, pass the word along. And thank you guys for coming to my Life of Charm channel. And I hope I'm charming you guys, by the way. All right. All right. Bye.